हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर स्टार्टिंग टेंस टॉपिक ऑफ ग्रामर टेंसेस इन इंग्लिश आर अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ग्रामर टॉपिक बाय व्हिच वी कैन कंस्ट्रक्ट सेंटेंसेस ओके सो बेसिकली वी नो ऑलरेडी दैट देयर आर ट्वेल्व टाइप्स ऑफ टेंसेस थ्री बेसिक टेंस प्रेजेंट पास्ट एंड फ्यूचर व्हिच आर क्लासिफाइड इन four different classifications that are simple continuous perfect and perfect continuous so we will uh, generally understand the verb forms and structural formulas of this all tenses 12 tenses and by this formulas you will be able to understand and transform the sentences from one tense into other tense first is simple present in simple present we use verb first in affirmative sentences and in negative and interrogative sentences we use the helping verb do does with verb first form okay in present continuous tense in continuous tenses we will always be using verb first plus ing form verbs ing form and helping verb will always be is am and are okay and present continuous tense means that actions hap- that are happening now so verb uh, this helping verbs are is am and are and verb first with ing form is being used in simple past tenses we will be using verb second in affirmative sentences and helping verb will use did and with verb first in negative and interrogative sentences past continuous mein aapka helping verb rahega was were and verb first ke sath mein aapka ing form rahega perfect pe aate hain will uh, in perfect present perfect will use helping verb has have and will use third form of verb in present perfect in present perfect continuous will be using have plus been so have plus been with verb for first form and ing will be present perfect continuous so <coughs> we have completed simple present that is do does plus verb first present continuous that is verb first plus ing present perfect that is has have plus verb third and present perfect continuous that is have been plus ing form so these are present and in simple past we have already done verb second in affirmative sentences and did plus verb first in negative and interrogative sentences in past continuous we will be using was were as helping verb and verb first plus ing in past perfect we will use helping verb had and verb third okay in past perfect continuous we will use helping verb had been and verb ki first form plus ing in future future simple mein we will use will plus verb first future continuous mein we will use will be plus verb first plus ing and in future perfect we will use will have plus verb third and in future perfect continuous we will be doing will have been plus verb first plus ing so these are some tenses then se aap in sentences se aap samajh payenge ki hum in tenses ke structures formulas ko kaise use karte hain jaise ki starting with present okay so in present what will do simple present he plays football every t- tuesday so plays is verbs first form if we will be doing here negative sentence then we'll use the verbs do and do or does with singular form we will use does and with plural form we will use do so he is a singular subject so therefore we'll use he does not play football every tuesday okay in present continuous that is present progressive also will be using is am and are so uh, he is singular subject so we will be using is he is and verb first form plus ing so he is playing football in present perfect we will be using has or have that is he has won five matches so far and verbs third form that is won in present perfect continuous we will be using has been has been or have been so it is singular subject so we will be using has been playing football for 10 years so these are simple present in simple past you can see here in affirmative sentences we will be using verb second form he played football every tuesday and if it the sentence would be negative we can say that he did not play football every tuesday the verb first will used with did in past continuous we will be using helping verb was and were with verbs first form plus ing so he was playing football 
and in past perfect we will be using verb helping verb had that is he had won five matches until that day and verbs third form will be used in past perfect continuous we will be using had been plus verb first form plus ing and since or for for time so for uh, time given at perfect fixed time that is monday tuesday or at fixed time 6 pm evening uh, thursday friday any days will be using since but whenever a fixed time period is not given that is 10 years 3 months will be using for so he had been playing football for 10 years coming to future tenses future simple is uh, will shall plus verb first so he will he will go to play football every tuesday okay in future continues he will be playing football will be plus verb first plus ing in future perfect we will uh, say here will have or shall have plus verb ki third form he will have won five matches by then and in future perfect continues we will be doing will have been plus verb first plus ing he will have been playing football for 10 years so these are your tenses completed here and students please learn this helping verbs and verbs form that are used in the tenses this will be uh, helping you in grammar topics such as rearranging the topics or tense transformation or indirect direct or indirect speeches so students practice these questions and practice a um, lot of sentences and try to transform these sentences into each tenses okay keep studying